want to make sure I understand this. If I don't get over the fact that you slept with Jason and you lied about it for months, you're leaving. Well, if that's the way you want to put it, yes. You know what? Don't sugarcoat it or anything. We might tiptoe around each other. Too much has happened. Yeah, that's the thing. You want me to pretend that it didn't happen. I want to stop keeping score. That's the vicious, never-ending cycle we seem to be stuck in, Lucky. You throw it in my face that I slept with Jason. I, I remind you that it started with you sleeping with Max. No, this is I slept nowhere. with Maxie because I was strung out on drugs. And I slept with Jason because you were strung out on drugs. Oh, so this is my fault. No, God, Lucky, this is what I'm talking about. What happened on both sides happened. We can't take it back. We can't change anything. I am tired of defending my decision not to tell you about Jason, but more so, I am so tired of having the same fight. It's hurting us. And this constant bitterness is eventually going to hurt our children, too. And I'm not going to do that to them. They're kids. They deserve to be raised in a, in a stable and loving home. And if we can't be adult enough to provide that for them, then yeah, then it's time for me to leave. So the ball's in your court. What are you willing to do to keep our family together? I'm not completely insensitive. I know how deeply I've hurt you. And not just with what happened with Jason, but because I didn't trust you enough to handle the truth in whatever way you needed. I'm sorry, Lucky. I can see now that that was a mistake. But you said you wanted to work things out, and ever since then, you've been punishing me. You've been angry, you've been passive-aggressive, and now you've just jumped a plain old aggressive. What do you mean? Come on, Lucky, you've been hanging out with Sam, who hits on you every chance she gets, and then rubs it in my face. And so do you, every time you let it stand. Let me ask you something. If I slept with Sam, would it matter? Or would you just take the chance to go back to Jason? God, Lucky, how many times do I have to tell you how many different ways? Jason is not an option. I did what I said I would, and I cut him out of my life. After you refused for months, you scolded me for having the nerve to ask. We've been through some difficult times. It doesn't help every time you run to Jason when things take a turn for the worse. I needed a friend. I practically begged you to stay away from Jason. And you refused. Why now? What's changed? Two men came out of nowhere when I was in the park with my boys and threatened to use us as leverage against Jason. I cannot let the danger that surrounds him jeopardize my children. In other words, you can't have Jason. So you settled for me.